Hey guys, it's Sergeant's Game. Bring you a Fortnite Save the World daily mission update and item shop update for Save the World for 217 of 2021. Guys, make sure you hit the like, subscribe, comment down below. Use the code now. Check. Really appreciate support, guys. Let's get started. Um, I noticed maybe I think they did something with the uh, alerts for the week, the weekly challenges, because I still have mine from last week. But maybe I just have to restart the game. It might be the restart the game problem, probably. But um, yeah. Oh, we have a lot of power outages here in Texas because of the weather, apparently. But uh, yeah, let's talk about the item shop. They got the Hemlock, good good one to buy if you haven't got it. It's a very good weapon. Don't 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 doubt it. It's a very good weapon. And they got the legendary broadside schematic in here. We got Pathfinder Jess. We got our legendary Flux, of course. We got a Hunter Killer. If you don't like the Hunter Killer, just buy it and scrap it. Maybe you'll get some better rolls. Uh, that's the one thing I forgot to mention. Is a the, the the new roll system that they had. If you have a lot of old schematics, the, you can't get the new ones. But unless you get more schematics or buy, spend V bucks to buy stuff. But buy the stuff in the item shop, or you can buy these random epic ones, a thousand gold, and you might get a better perk weapon. Never know. If you have a lot of gold, what you willing to waste? <laughs> get your two epic survivors. Get your Evo mats if you need them. If you're low level, so leveling up, make sure you buy these. So when you get to that point, you'll be able to, you know, evolve your stuff. Rather than be like, oh no, I can't evolve my stuff. The epic puck, epic bucks. Uh, make sure you get that. All right, I'm gonna buy all this in here in a sec. I just want to talk about it real quick. Um, in my next video, we'll be talking about the daily home base update. Or the home status home base update, whatever it's called. But um, we're just gonna talk about the item shop and the missions today, okay? Buy that broadside if you don't need it. Just buy it just to scrap it or collection book it. Okay, let's see. We get the epic flux or legendary flux. I don't need Pathfinder Jess though. She's a very good outlander, by the way. If you didn't know. Very good Outlander. Then you got Legendary version. If you want the Legendary version, the event shop would be on water. The hardest thing to get in this game is Epic and Legendary Flux. It's easy to get, but it takes a long ass time to stack it up. Because you only get 50 Legendary every week. They used to give us 100. I think so a long time ago. But, uh, the Epic Flux, though, you can. They give you 100 on Epic Flux, though. Just imagine you were collecting this since day one. You would have so much legendary flux. Oh. Anyways. Alright, that's that on that. Okay. Oh, let me, um, I wanted to see what the rolls are on my hemlock. Ah, not the one I wanted. Okay. Sometimes you get good rolls, as long as you don't. Okay, those were really bad rolls. All right. Well, I, I kind of oh, I need a collection bucket. Yeah, I need a collection bucket. Okay, we collection bucket. I don't have one in the collection book. All right. Alright, let's get on to the missions. So we have a. Let me go full screen. We have a 70 V Bucks in Candy Valley, guys. There's one in a 52 4 Atlas for 35 V Bucks. We have a 46 RTL with 35 V Bucks. And let's go check out the honorable rewards today. Alright, let's see. We got a. Is that good enough for y'all? Okay. Alright. Got a 58. Retrieve the data for a vacuum tube rifle. Master driver 64 zone. Zapatron 82 zone. Hostile for 88 zone. Long armor forcer 88 zone. Sunsider 100 zone. Legendary survivor 108 zone. Lead gadgeteer legendary 124 zone. Stonefoot crash 124 zone. Lead Nullage Gadgeteer Legendary 124 zone. Hust Stomper, another Hust Stomper 140 zone. Retractable Force Spikes in the 70 zone. 
Uh, I just leveled up the Hust Thumper. Actually, I got a really good one. I just leveled one up. It's pretty debatable. Well, I like the Hust. Hust Thumper is like in the top 10 of impact melees, last I checked when I was looking into it. It, it, it kind of, it's kind of like a it's kind of like the what's it called it's kind of like the Baron does the same heavy attack melee heavy attack anyways we got another retractable four spikes husk cleaver space invader freedom zero lead marksman better tech disintegrator home or doom hammer one shot epic survivor templar pulverizer zap zap freedom zero neon scythe triple tap Support Specialist Hawk, Long Arm Enforcer, Harvester Sarah, uh, Epic Survivor, Ceiling Gas Trap, Death Ray, Wood Enforced Spikes, Venertech, Pulsar. Alright, let's see if there's any good in Canny, any good missions. Nope, okay, waste time. But let's go check out the Twine Missions. Alright, we got a five times schematic quad fire and metal corrosion. Um oh, you can put on a brick. Brick is your best bet for the five times schematic. What else is there? There's an RTD for a reperk if you need to do that. It's a fire enemies. Um uh, metal or brick. We got a five times in a row. Oh, yeah, I got a 160 with Reaper. That might be better. Yeah. Uh, wood or brick on the 160 RTD with five times Reaper. There's a 160 RTL with nature, brick, or wood. Five times Storm Shard. Oh, no, I have the Storm. Sorry. I have the Storm. Sorry. We got to repair the shelter with. Okay, never mind. Don't do that one. That was kind of nasty. Well, you could do that one. That's not bad. I mean, it's kind of bad, but not that bad. Oh, two legendary, two epic on a repair if you're really desperate. It's up to you. Uh, let's see. Well, that was a 108 RTL with water, but out of brick or, I mean, wood or metal. That has 200 lightning in a bottle if you need that. A 143 Atlas, a 140. Rescue the, or no, yeah, rescue the survivors, 140 RTL. What else is there, 140? We got an RTD, 140, RT8, or single Atlas, 140. Hmm. 140 evac the shelter. Okay, okay. Too bad today. Interesting missions. Then we got Adventures. Let's go see what Adventure has to offer. I'm still leveling up Adventures. I haven't had much time to grind it with the power outages lately. RTL 140, RTD. Uh, deliver a bomb 140. What else we got? Two Atlas 140, Evac the Shelter 140. 140, Eliminate Collect. 140, Deliver the Bomb. A four times schematic, Fire Enemies. A build out of brick or metal. 108 retrieve. Four times legendary. That's pretty good. Fire and metal corrosion, but out of brick only. Then you got a three epic and a one legendary on a repair. That's going to be really boring, though. Yeah, that's the only commission adventures. Hmm. There's a 140 repair the shelter. Water enemies built out of metal or wood. Um, got a couple one-off missions that aren't too bad either. Well, there you go. Four times legendary adventures. Not too bad today. Um, something else I was going to... I think that was... Was that all I'm going to talk about today? I think that's all I going to talk about today. I guess so. Yeah. Anyways, the next video we'll be talking about the home base status update for 216 of 2021 guys anyways make sure to like like don't forget to sub comment down below use the code name shop really appreciate that support guys and we'll see y'all in the next video use the code name shop and every two weeks and make sure you use an epic games checkout guys we'll see y'all guys later
If you do, buy stuff on my computer, of course. You can buy it on the phone, actually, too, if you didn't know. Um, if you sign in on your Epic accounts, they have free games every one to two weeks. They throw out a free game. I mean, if you sign in with your account, it's a free game. It's not complicated. I'll have to make a video on that, too. But, you know, you just sign in, go to the Epic Games website on your browser, sign in, and then you just go to the little free game section, and, like, you literally just click on it, and... It like purchases it for free and then there's no charge. You don't need to add a debit or credit card to buy it either. It's free, it's free. And uh, yeah, it's, I mean, they're okay. They're not like great games, but occasionally they have a really good game, you know. The best game I think they've only had is, um, uh, from what I can remember, which is the best value, was this Lego Star Wars bundle. No, 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 no Lego Star Wars, sorry, the, the Lego Batman version they had arkham knight and then they had a couple lego games and another arkham knight game and that was all free it was like within a one month period i was like dang that was a really good deal and that was about like a 60 60 value but yeah you know anyways i'll see you guys later